Okay, well first off, I uh, learned this from Mike O'Hearn, watching uh, him and, uh, what's the British guy, the British chef's name? Uh, look at me, Robert Irvine. Uh, so it's Mike O'Hearn and Robert Irvine were doing a YouTube video. So the first move I learned from them, I'm cold, so I'm just showing you the move. I mean, yeah, I can do this with more than five pounds, but here it is. So, you know, a lot of the tricep moves are like this. What they showed in their video is that you do it like this and basically touch your pec back and forth. Or obviously you could hold it, you know, and do that, you know, variations. Or hold it like this and do that. You know, time under tension, basically. Uh, the other move that I found that helps uh, take a lot of the tricep tension off is like here there's more. So a lot of times if it's a really heavy weight, I'll just go from here and move it out a little bit so it doesn't stretch my elbow as much. It seems to really, uh, you know, avoid putting as much tension on that and you still get kind of on the same form. It's not a huge difference. It's more like here, you know, versus here. Um, and again, you know, th this light weight doesn't make any difference, but if I'm doing really heavy weight, I find if I have it here, it just puts so much tension on my elbow. You know, I'll just move it out a little bit. Sometimes I'll even move it out that far, and you can still see that you're getting a tricep workout. You know, is it as good? I don't know, but this one was a big difference, uh, you know, as far as putting the tension on. I can do the same weight that hurts here. I can do that same way here, and it's a lot less. And it, these are all just different ways to work the tricep, keep you from getting bored, challenge the muscle, etc. So give me a subscribe. More videos are coming. We're up to almost 200 videos and 3,000 subscribers, so I really appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Be true, Rob.